Hello everyone, take a white sheet of paper and then using a compass, make a circular shape on it. Add some tape on the circular shape and then add some hay all around it. Add a yellow circular clay piece on middle and then draw a face onto it. In the bottom, make the body and then draw the legs and the tail. This will be a lion. Take a blue rectangular sheet of paper, then take a yellow circular sheet of paper. Stick the circular sheet of paper on the blue paper. Add multiple sides to make it look like a sun. Now we will be learning how to make this game. Start off by drawing this kind of box. Draw multiple of them, 9 to be specific, and then add bottle caps all over them. Add triangles on the top. Now we will be learning how to draw this bouquet. Take some cardboard paper and then drop it in white paint and then spread it out on a black sheet of paper as such. Now take a circular sponge, dip it in paint of any color that you like, make swirls all around the paper. Add small little dots of the same color all over and then paint on the stems. Add a little bow as well. Finally, this is what it should look like. Now we will be learning how to make this 3D flower. So start off by taking a circular sheet of paper and then cut it up in a spiral. Stick it on either end of a rectangular sheet of paper after folding it. Now take a square sheet of paper, fold it over two times and then make a slightly curved cut on it. Stick it all around the spiral after you have made multiple flowers and then open and close it as you please. We will be learning how to make this 3D bouquet. Take a rectangular sheet of paper and then using a marker or a sketch pen, add multiple lines to denote the stems. Then add multiple scrunched up balls of paper of different colors. At the bottom, add the bouquet using some tissue paper. Start off by taking a white rectangular sheet of paper. Then take multiple balls of clay. Stick the main color at the top and then on top of that, stick the yellow color to denote the center of the flower. Draw on the stems and then stick on the waves. Take a white sheet of paper and then very roughly cut out the body of an animal. Then stick the head, stick some ears and the tail as well. Draw on the eyes and then the eyebrows and then make the mouth. Add some spots all over to make it look like a Dalmatian. Use some clay to make the collars. Now we will be learning how to make these ties. Start off by drawing a tie shape on a sheet of paper and then cut it out. Add multiple balls of clay to decorate it. Add clay at the top to make the handle as well. You may use different designs to do so. We have made stripes, we have made flowers and polka dots. Start off by taking a pink square sheet of paper, fold it over diagonally and then open up the sheet of paper. Fold in the sides to make it meet in the center and then cut off the top. Make multiple of these and then stick them together to make the top of a kite. Now make curved shapes underneath it, add the grass, add the sun as well as the clouds. Start off by adding a yellow bottom, denote the sand. Then take multiple red circular sheets of paper, fold them in half, make the crab as well as its claws. Draw on some grass or you may use it, some green paper. Take a black rectangular sheet of paper, cut out the shape of a dress on it and then stick it on another rectangular sheet of paper. Take multiple balls of clay and then stick it to the bottom to design it. Take a white rectangular sheet of paper then using some black paint make the stems of the box of a tree. Taking some sponge dip it in green paint and then make the top of a tree. Use a toothbrush at the bottom to make the grass look more realistic. Add apples all over using some clay. You may add small other details like bees and other such things. Take a yellow circular sheet of paper and then draw multiple spirals on it. Add a ground, some grass and a curvy house as well. This will be a very abstract painting or a drawing. Carve it in as you please and then in the whirlpool add some houses and some trees. Cut out the shape of a burger and then stick them apart from each other. In the middle of them, add multiple layers to it such as mustard, some tomato, sauce or even some lettuce. Finally, this is what it should look like. Add fries to the side. Thank you for watching.